Hello everyone, my name is Winters and welcome back to this Let's Play a series of Car Mechanic Simulator 2018. We are continuing on exactly from where we left off. We currently have three orders in the garage. Uh, this one here is an experience order which we will be working on next. This is a money bon bonus order and that one down the back there is a money bonus order as well. Uh, this is a little project that we've been working on uh, over the course of various episodes. We might be working on it again. Uh, in this episode, I don't know. It depends on how time uh, goes for us. Uh, we picked that up from a like a scrapyard or uh, a barn location or something like that, and uh, we've been making some good progress on it. Anyway, uh, like I said, we're going to get started on this bad boy. So let's take a gander. Actually, let's mm, let's put it up on the lift. Um, all right, we'll pop the hood, and we're going to take a gander here. Repair all engine faults. And there's quite a few. Strange noises from the engine bay. Timing needs replacing. Let's uh, mark those off as well. Car cannot start. I'm thinking starter or ignition distributor maybe. Lack of engine power. That's definitely spark plugs and ignition wires, that kind of thing. Uh, replace engine oil and filter. Okay, we can mark off the filter anyway. Uh, let's do some tests. Uh, so, just for the sake of thoroughness, we'll uh, break out the old tire thread tester and see what the tires are like. I'm expecting everything to be fine there, and indeed it is. Uh, next, we're going to break out the old multimeter and uh, check the electronics of this car. I can already see already, I mean, that intake manifold is in dire straits. It is in really bad condition. Alternator, starter, throttle, all need replacing on this uh, order. All right, compression test next. Uh, that's going to tell us uh, the pistons, piston rings, uh, that kind of stuff. Uh, uh, the guts of the engine and what it's like. Piston with Conrad, piston, with ring, uh, piston rings. Uh, yeah, okay, so we have to break the engine down a fair bit. Uh, next, we're going to break out the OBD scanner, onboard diagnostic scanner. And that will tell us things like spark plugs, uh, ignition wires, uh, that kind of stuff. Ignition coils, spark plugs. Yep, okay, so that's revealed a fair bit for us. Finally, we'll do a fuel pressure test. Uh, this will tell us about the fuel pump, fuel filter, uh, that kind of stuff. Uh, fuel filter needs replacing, fuel rail needs replacing. Okay, we found out a lot of items there. So let's mark everything off that we have discovered. Um, because that'll give us an idea on what parts of the car we need to work on. Strange noises. Uh, okay, so alternator and starter. Timing we've already done. Car cannot start. That's a spark plug. Uh, lack of engine power. Uh, ignition coil, fuel rail, more ignition coils, fuel filter. Yep. And replace. Yeah, alright. Okay. Um... All right, fuel filter, you can come off. Uh, throttle, you can come off. This intake manifold. Let's get the fuel rails out first. Uh, we need to work on the timing. I can see the water pump is something else that needs work on. Some idler rollers. Maybe water pump pulley. Belt tensioner, you can come off. That needs replacing. That power steering pump doesn't look like it's in great condition either. We do still have a lot of things to discover on this. Uh, the belt needs replacing as suspected. Uh, water pump, you can come out. Okay. Right, let's get this. Oh, it's a supercharger. Not a, it's not an intake manifold, it's a supercharger. Uh, oh my. This is the intake manifold. Uh, that head. That head needs to come off. Uh, so let's get these ignition coils out. And we'll take off the head cover. Right, so let's see, if I need to get down there, then I need to disassemble the timing. Let's take out these ignition uh, 
coils. And let's start working on getting these rollers off. The alternator, we may as well take that off because it has to be replaced. Uh, da, 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 more rollers over here. All need to come off because we need to get at the timing head cover. Now the crankshaft pulley, and I believe oh, this engine head is going to have to come off as well. Okay, that's fine. Alright, now we can get the engine timing head cover off. That sump needs to be replaced as well, I can see that. Uh, right, let's get the belts off next, timing belts. And cogs need to be replaced. Well, this camshaft needs to be replaced. And so does this one, actually. Alright, let's go back over here. That camshaft is fine. This one's in dire straits. Uh, exhaust manifold, you need to come off. Uh, spark plugs. Now we can get the head off. Okay. Now. Does the other head need to come off? It does because there's a piston there that needs to come out. So let's take off these. Or take out these spark plugs and we'll take off this head as well. Uh, don't forget about the exhaust manifold on this side. Alright, now we can get the head. Okay. Um, there isn't much else that we can do. I can do a visual inspection on the... I can't, actually. Okay. Ah, the radiator looks fine. Uh, I do want to do a visual inspection on the air. Oh, look, needs to be replaced, needs to be replaced. Check the clips. I suspect all the clips are fine. Yeah. Okay. So uh, let's get the clips off. And we'll get the air filter cover off and the air filter itself. And now we're going to lift up the car and start working underneath it. Uh, actually, before we do that, let's drain the oil because that has to be done anyway. Oh, look at that oil. It's so black. Yeah, that definitely needs replacing. Okay. Um, oil filter V8. I need to remember that. Okay. So it's this piston here that needs to come off. So let's get these rod caps off. And this one here needs new rings. That crankshaft cap looks like it needs to be replaced. This one here needs to be done, so off you come. Uh, let's pick something else. Yeah, that's fine there. This piston needs to come out. Okay, I think, I think that's it. We can now pull out the pistons. So, let's drop her down. And let's see which ones of these need working on. Alright, so this one. This one. This one. And... Shit, I don't think I done them. Oh, I did. Phew. Okay. Uh, now we're going to see what parts we can recondition, if any. Okay, so power steering pump. Supercharger, fuel rail, rod caps, clips, exhaust manifolds, good bit of stuff. Excellent. Right, now we're going to put pistons in. Now I think I might have some pistons. I do. 
Let's just put all new in. That's the best thing to do. Alright, and I think I need two more... Yeah, alright, two more pistons and rings. So we'll do a search for piston. Uh, alright, piston rings by two. Piston with Conrad by two. And back we go. Okay, now engine head. Let's put the reconditioned one back on here. And we'll buy a new one for the other side since we weren't able to recondition that. Alright, so it's uh, engine head V8. So we'll do a search for V8. And we'll go down to the E's. Engine block, engine head, V8. There it is there. Wow, 1350. That's the spicy meatball. Wunderbar. Right, now camshafts. We have two. Cam gears. Any of those reconditioned? No. Right, so what were the camshafts? They were just straight up V8, weren't they? Okay, so let's buy those. Uh, looking, looking, looking. Camshaft. V8. There. We need two of them. I probably should have taken note of other items as well, but it's it's not the end of the world. Cam gears. Let's let's mm, let's go with spark plugs. Shit. Um, oh, we need a new supercharger. Okay, let's get that supercharger V8 down to the S's. Where are we? Should be around here somewhere. Supercharger V8. There it is. There. Um, we needed a throttle as well, and that kind of does look like the one that we took off, I think. So I'll take a gamble on that. Now I need cam gears, don't I? Cam gear. Is that right? No, there's a space in between it. Cam gear. Uh, let's buy four of those. Alright, let's get these cam gears on. Okay, now timing belts. How were they? Ooh, I need two timing belts. Okay. Fuel rails. Uh, reconditioned ones can go back into it. Um, spark plugs. Second hand ones can go back in. New one here. New one here. And a new one here. Alright, so that means second hand can go in here. Uh, second hand can go in here. And second hand one can go in here. And that just leaves a second hand one to go in there. Okay. Uh, alternator. Did we recondition that? We did not. Power steering pump. Reconditions, so that can go back on. Uh, I'm kind of stuck. Well, I suppose the the exhaust manifolds they can go back on. And the same the far side. Lovely. Right, I think we've kind of reached an impasse. We need 
Do I have a fuel filter? I don't. Uh, we need to we need to buy those timing belts. All right, timing belts V8, wasn't it? Let's hope my memory doesn't betray me. Timing. So we'll go down here to the T's. Getting close. All right. Timing belt V8, and we want two of them. So we get this one on first. Then we'll get this one on. And the timing head cover goes back on, reconditioned, all shiny, sparkly new. Okay. Engine head cover. And this head cover. Alright, now the ignition coils. Uh, we need a new one here. We need a new one here. We need a new one here. Alright, and wow, it's actually four new ones here. I don't think I have enough. Right, so a second hand one can go on there. Then the head cover. Throttle, I know I bought that. Oh, wow, I already had some. I did not need to buy it. Oh well, we'll use them at some point in the future. Uh, right, let's see. Ignition coils and the alternator I can do. The rollers, let's get those in next here. Crankshaft pulley. Idler roller B. We'll get as many of these in as we possibly can, and when we reach an impasse, then we will go out and buy a bunch of stuff. Water pump, did we? No, we didn't recondition it. Okay. Uh, belt. We need a new belt. <coughs> Supercharger belt. Alright. I need to remember that. Um, Alright, fuel filter, ignition coil, alternator, water pump, and belt. Let's try it. There's the belt. Uh, ignition coil. Let's buy like seven of them. Then we'll have six left over. Uh, fuel filter. And I think I need a fuel pump. Um, water pump. It was V8, wasn't it? I think it was V8. <coughs> Excuse me. There it is there. Um... Water pump pulley. I think we might need one of those. Uh, alternator. Alt. Alternator. There we go. Okay. That's not bad now. We can get cracking with the next stage. Sweet. I did get the right water pump. Uh, let's put the belt back on. And the water pump pulley. And, oh shit, I need a belt tensioner. Damn it. Alternator, you're going back on. Uh, ignition coil, you can go back on. Then the cover. Uh, fuel filter, you can go back on. We have another belt here. All right, uh, belt A V8. All right. Belt AV is, and we need um, a belt tensioner. Belt tensioner. And V8, and we're looking for a uh, belt A, wasn't it?
built a V8. Where are you, you little son of a bitch? There it is there. And we probably need a belt B. So let's look for a belt B V8. There we go. We'll buy that as well. And oil filter. Wait. Uh, PQ. Uh, yeah, up here. There we are. We'll buy that oil filter. Uh, I don't know what oil pan we need. Um, it's probably this one. You know what? Screw it. Let's just take a chance. And we'll buy it. Okay. Belt tensioner next. Oh, I forgot about the air filter. Damn it. Uh, is that everything done? Do I have an air filter? I don't have an air filter. Do you know what? Let's mark off what we've done and what we haven't. That's... Uh, probably the best thing we can do now at this stage. Okay, strange noises from the engine bay. The starter. All the timing stuff is done. Uh, spark plug is done. Lack of engine power. Air filter cover. Contributed to lack of engine power. Wow, that's a new one. Okay. We are looking good. Uh, let's raise her up. And while we're doing that, let's get an air filter. There's the air filter. Alright, now let's get a gander's under here. So start for us to come off. And I think I have a starter. I don't. Uh, right, so let's get the bottom end of this done. Crankshaft bearing cap. Reconditions. And there's the last rod cap. And now the oil pan. Sweet, it was an oil pan V8. I love it when I take chances on things and it works out just perfectly. Uh, oil filter. Must not forget about that. Uh, right. Uh, was the fuel pump something that needed to be worked on? Let's take a gander. Uh, no, it looks alright. Yeah, it's fine. I didn't need to purchase that one, but no matter. We'll use it at some point in the future. Um, it's just the air filter now, isn't it? Alright, let's get the air filter in. Then we'll get the air cover on. Oh, we need new air cover. Air filter cover. Okay. Air filter cover. Our bases. Maybe I should be looking at the names of these instead of the pictures. That's a B6, that ain't right. Shit. I'm looking for one that kind of marries up to what we want. I am not seeing it. I must be blind. Ah, here it is. There we go. 40 bucks for that damn thing. Okay, now the clips. Oh shit, I forgot the starter. I have to put her back up again. Ah! Okay, lift her back up. Can I recondition the starter? I should be able to. starter back on. How did I muck that up? Okay, now she can be brought down for the last time.
and all that's left to be done is to put some oil in the engine. Should be done any second here now. There we go. Alright. Let's see if there's anything that we have missed. So all done there. All done there. All done there. All done there. Looks like, yeah, all done there. And all done here. Excellent. Job complete. So we spent 9,500 on parts and we're... <laughs> We're getting over 36,000 in payouts. <laughs> oh my god, that's just so ridiculous. It's freaking awesome, but it's like, you know, Jesus, imagine if things really cost that much. Right, uh, we are going to leave it there for now. Thanks a million for watching, folks. I hope you all enjoyed this episode. If you did, please like, comment, and subscribe. Do all that good stuff. Uh, my name is Winters, and I will catch you next time. So until then, take care.